Central Florida hospitals are being told by the state not to expect more first doses of the COVID-19 vaccine. Local officials told Channel 9 they weren't surprised as the health department leans more toward neighborhood pharmacies instead of centralized medical complexes to give the shot. We have monitored this transition over the last couple of weeks. Florida Governor Ron DeSantis has crisscrossed the state of Florida and central Florida. He's visited local public stores from Marion to Brevard counties that have started to vaccinate people 65 and older. Good evening. I'm Greg Wormuth. I'm Vanessa Eccles. Let's dig deeper now into the changes with the first reporter in central Florida to break this story. Channel 9's Deanna Albright joins us live. Deanna, one local hospital official told you they were anticipating some of what unfolded today. Yes, Vanessa, they were expecting some shift away from hospitals as the state tried to expand more access. But the Florida Hospital Association CEO tells me that at the time they were really wanting to see some of the work that these regional systems were doing, like Orlando Health, as we've reported, that already used some of their regional clinics to be able to do this on some level. Well, now Publix pharmacies, like the one you're seeing now, seems to be the way the state has decided to expand access. They've already done this and 18 counties across the state. This news, though, means we'll likely see more of them in play as the state shifts away from hospitals as vaccine distributors. I only go out to go to the grocery store or run to the pharmacy once in a while. Two and a half weeks ago, Osceola so County resident I'm Jan Shepard thought I... Governor Ron DeSantis's announcement about the vaccine going to Publix was going to be her shot at getting the shot. And then we realized the Osceola County Publixes are not included in the list. And it left a lot of us wondering here in Central Florida, what about um, opening up Publix locations for vaccine distribution here in Central Florida? But when State Representative Carlos Guillermo Smith went digging around to find out how to get Orange County involved and get more vaccines, he found the reality was more complicated. The Publix distribution is not new supply of vaccines. That is actually from the same uh, supply stream of vaccines that is going to our county health departments. But just confirmed today, Publix locations with the vaccine will likely be receiving more because the supply will now include everything that would have gone to Florida's hospitals before. The state has said that hospitals should not expect at this time future allocations of first doses. Instead, the shift will be to government-run sites, churches, and retail pharmacies like Publix. Florida Hospital Association CEO Mary Mayhew says they did expect some shift on the path to expanding access. A complete removal of hospitals from the supply, though, was not expected because leaving out hospitals entirely could be tough for medically vulnerable patients under 65, who hospitals were previously able to vaccinate at their discretion. The hospitals will continue to partner with uh, other resources in the community to prioritize those populations getting access to the vaccine. I did reach out to our local hospital systems about how exactly that would work, but I haven't been able to get specifics yet. Another important question all of this, what about all of our Central Florida counties that don't have a partnership with Publix yet? That's more than 2 million Central Floridians. I did ask the state about this. They said that they are working to get me a response. One ad additional question that I just got on Twitter, what happens to all of these health care workers, non-hospital health care workers, that the hospitals were in charge of vaccinating. Live in Orlando, Deanna Albritton, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.